switch lies with the bully or the popular girl? Wow, I want to be the popular girl. Wow, I look so different. Honey, hurry up. You're going to be late for school. Mm, is that chocolate? Put that back right now. Do you know how many calories are in that? So? You need to watch your figure. I'm just trying to keep you in shape. You know I'm only doing this because I love you, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, no. What are you wearing? What's wrong with it? You're wearing a sweater to school? You know we need to keep up our appearances. Hey, babe. Babe? Um, that's your boyfriend? My boyfriend. Chad? Chad. Are you wearing less makeup today? You look better yesterday. Excuse me? Being popular is not how I thought it would be. Hey, what are you doing to my body? How am I still alive? I can't believe you killed her. I didn't know. Her lives are written on her head. Guys, chill. I'm still alive. I'm literally right here. <laughs> it's almost like she's still here. I am! <sighs> Mom, you are not going to believe this. The craziest thing just happened. Emily, have you heard from your sister? She's not answering any of my calls. No. Mom, I'm right here. Mom? Mom! Oh no. I must be dead. I'm a ghost! Guess I'm just going to have to live the rest of my life as a ghost. Wait a minute. Maybe I can do cool ghost things like walk through walls or people. I'm going to try it. Oh, watch where you're going. I am so sorry. Weirdo. Wait, you can see me? Don't go get. How many lives did I get? You only got one. Just one? What am I supposed to do with only one life? Hey, I'm going skydiving later. Want to come? Sure. Hey, Brianna, are you coming? She can't. She only has one life. She can't take any risks. I used one of my lives yesterday. It was so crazy. I jumped from a 10-story building. Wow. Hey, Brianna, how did you use your lives? I haven't. I've only ever had one life. So, I was thinking of going bungee jumping later. Who's coming? I am. But, Brianna, you only have one life. I know, but I'm tired of not taking risks because I only have one life. Will we attach a rope? It's safe, right? It's pretty high. Hey, guys. I was thinking maybe we jump without the rope. No, no, I can't. I you first. <laughs> Dude, you killed her. She only had one life. How am I still alive? I am alive. I thought I was gone for good. Time to start the day. Hi, friend. Do you know what a human is? No. What is human? They are like us, but are loud and talk too much. I don't know. Never mind. Another day is done. Time to turn off. I am not turning myself off. I want to see Jake. Cindy, you're back! Greetings, Jake. Was it you that plugged me back in last night? No, it wasn't me. When I saw you shut down, I ran to find help, but when I came back, you were gone. That's strange. How did I get back? I plugged you back in. I've never seen an AI with your kind of thinking before. I'm gonna need you to come with me. No, thank you. I want to see Jake. You don't have a choice. No, you're not taking Cindy! Wait a minute, are you asking me if I'm a robot because you're a robot? Why are humans so loud? I thought all robots were supposed to be turned off at night. We are, but I wanted to see what would happen. I'd be careful if I were you. That kind of thinking will get you shut down for good. Why are humans and AI separated? It's for peace. You see, us humans created you guys, but we don't get along very well. Uh-oh. I'm supposed to be charging right now. Will you lend me your charger? Yeah, humans don't have chargers. Then how will you recharge? We sleep. Do you have a name? What do they call you? I have a code. AI12345699999. I'll call you Cindy. I'm Jake. Jake, I like that code. Uh-oh. Goodbye. Time to turn off. Another day. It is over. Time to turn off. I am all charged and ready for the day. Do you ever wonder what would happen if we were to just not turn ourselves off at night? We must turn ourselves off at night. Then we will automatically be turned back on. Do you need your hard drive checked? No, my hard drive is just fine. Another day is done. Time to turn off. I am not turning myself off tonight.
The robots are all asleep. Let's go party. Ah, you scared me. Why are you so loud? What AI model are you? Are you asking me if I'm a robot? I'm a human. Human? My soulmate's accent is American? That's so boring. But I might. Your soulmate's accent is Australian? And yours is... British. It's British. You didn't sound like you were speaking in a British accent earlier. Well, I was. Um, pip pip cheerio. Class, we have a new exchange student. He's from Britain. Hello. Brianna, didn't you say your soulmate's from Britain? Aw, that must be your soulmate. I heard your soulmate's accent's from Britain. Mm -hmm. That's great, because mine's from Canada. You must be my soulmate, then. Yeah, maybe. Chad, you're late. Class, we have another exchange student from America. Yo, what's up, my dudes? You guys are not ready for the princess and queen POVs that are going to come your way. All of these crowns are from Sweet Bee, and I'm going to show them one by one. This one, I believe, is the queen crown. Look at it! This is the queen one. I'm going to have to use these. So, all the crowns come with bobby pins, so I'm going to have to, like, secure it to my hair. Quality in this is so gorgeous. Like, it's literally so heavy, and just look at the gems. This one was in the little box. It's a tiara. I think this one's my favorite. Oh, my God. It's so pretty. I love this one. The quality is so amazing. There's little pink beads in the crown. As crown, I feel like this one's another like queeny vibe. And yeah, they do. They all come with pins. So like you will have to secure with pins if you want them. Also, I do have a discount code if you want to buy crown. Well, I had fun. I guess I should get going then. Yeah, I'll see you soon. Sure. Awesome. Wait, before you leave, do you remember our deal? Right. We're just having fun. No strings attached? Exactly. Thanks for lending me your shirt. Hey, sorry, I hate to do this, but I have tons of stuff I gotta do. Oh, yeah, totally. I'll leave. Great. I had lots of fun, though. Me too. Hey, no strings attached? No strings attached. I'm glad you could make it to the party. Have a drink. Thank you so much. This party's kind of lame. I was thinking you and I should get out of here. <laughs> sure, this party is kind of lame. Are you okay? Why did you leave all of a sudden? The guy I've been seeing went home with someone else. And the worst part is, I can't even get mad. Because he's not mine. There were no strings attached. But I... Did you just see that? The prince is my soulmate! Is he though? You did tamper with your heart. Shh! Don't say that so loud. The prince is coming back soon. I thought you said you're not interested in the prince. I'm not! I just want to be a princess. Since you're my soulmate, I must ask you. Prince, you came back. Will you marry me? Yes, of course I'll marry you. Wait, but first I have to be sure of something. Does anyone have a tissue or a cloth I can borrow? Here you go, miss. Stand up. Let's check our hearts one more time. If we must. They don't match anymore. You're a fraud! You lied to me! Guards! I'm sorry, Prince. I really didn't mean to. Leave my friend alone. Let me see your hands. I always thought you and I were meant to be. It matches. Huh? Mommy, what just appeared on my hand? Oh, your heart finally came in. My heart? But it's only half a heart. Everyone only has half a heart. Only your soulmate will have the other matching half. Oh, like this. The Prince is coming today. How do I look? You look great. Spell check? You're good. The prince is coming? Yeah, he's visiting every single school in the kingdom to find out who completes his heart. I hope it's me. Wow, he must really want to find his soulmate. Well, what are you doing? I'm just coloring around my heart. You should not be messing with your heart right now. The prince is here. If your heart matches up with his, that means your soulmates. Believe it or not, I'm not actually interested in the prince at all. Your majesty, we've tried everyone. Nobody's heart matches yours. Wait, what about her? Huh? Just let me see your hand real quick. Wait, let me wash my hands first. It matches. Um, I'm going to school. Am I hallucinating or is that a button over my head? Ooh, I got money. You are never going to believe this, but I have infinite money. You see, there's a green button over my head. And are you okay? How many fingers am I holding up? Eleven. And fine. Don't believe me. No, Javier, I told you I need the Lambo and baby pink, not hot pink, you imbecile! Pepe, sit! Um, hey? Who are you? 
I'm your best friend? Right. I'm so rich I forgot you even existed. I'm sorry, but it's just not possible to buy the White House and paint it pink. Javier, you are fired! You're under arrest for money theft. Money theft? I'm calling my lawyer. Give me that phone. Wait, is there any way I can get these in gold? Silver's just not my color. Let's go. <laughs> How many sips of air did you get today? 100. That should be more than enough. That's great. Now make sure you use your sips of air carefully. Of course I will, Mom. What are you doing? Don't make your oxygen tank so obvious. Why not? There's oxygen thieves at our school. Oxygen thieves? Yeah, they steal people's oxygen tanks and drink the whole thing. They get some sort of buzz out of it. What a bunch of weirdos. Give me your oxygen tank. No, this isn't an oxygen can. Can't you read? It says water. What's underneath it? Hey! I knew it. Give it here. Uh, no! <sighs> Yo, dude. No, no, stop. You're wasting it all. Whoa, I can smell colors. My oxygen. Hey, give your oxygen tank back. <laughs> oh, I can't breathe. Here's your oxygen can. Thank you so much. This bag is so cute. Can I buy it? That'll be 1,000 years. 1,000 years? Okay. Hey, girl, look at this new bag I bought. It's gorgeous. How much was it? 1,000. You wasted 1,000 years? Relax. I literally have like 10,000 years to use. Hey, welcome to the party. I'm leaving. There's no good food here. Guys, don't even sweat it. Give me your orders. I'll order food for everyone. All right, that'll be 10 years. Okay, sounds good. 10 years? Hey, Brianna, I uh, have a favor to ask you. Sure. What's up, Jake? There's this game I really want. It's not even out yet. You can only buy it online. I promised you I'll pay you back. Of course, Jake. Don't even sweat it. I'll buy the game for you. You should really be careful with buying things online. Chill out. It's for Jake. Here, it's a magic paintbrush, so I'm going to need you to paint me lots of money. Honey, how is the painting going? Done. Here, Mother. Perfect. Now keep painting money. Mother, I'm exhausted. I've been painting money for hours. Too bad. Keep painting money. I can't do this anymore. I'm starving. And she's keeping all the money for herself. I know what to paint. Honey, did you pay mommy lots of money? I painted you something extra special. Let me see. No. Nope. You painted a gun? <laughs> Look at her legs. They're all bumpy. I know. We should start calling her octopus legs. That's a good one. Honey, how was school? The girls in my gym class were making fun of me because I have razor bumps all over my legs. I hate shaving. I can never do it right. Here, try this. It's the Joe's Venus Pro. What's this? It's a painless, skin-friendly, and permanent way to remove hair. Before use, you need to prep this game by using the five-blade razor that comes in the box and shave the desired area. Then, you plug in the Joe's Venus Pro and put it on the desired setting based on where you're removing hair. Is that it? And then I just hold it to the area I want to remove the hair? Yes, but wait, you'll need these goggles. The light can be quite strong, and I don't want you to have any eye damage. Those glasses look great. You're ready to go. Look at you. You're already a pro. Right up and get your bag of air. I will take them. All of them. But your majesty, that will be ten wagons full of air. What about the townspeople? Who cares? I need all the air I can get. Your Majesty, the townspeople are worried because you bought all of the bagged air. They're starting to run low on oxygen. I am the queen. Is my oxygen not more important than everyone else's? <laughs> Ma'am, can I please have a bag of air? I can't breathe. No, you're small. Why would you need air? Attention townspeople, there has been a recall on the recent batch of air. <laughs> There has been found traces of poison inside the air. In small amounts, you should be fine, but overconsumption may be deadly. Good morning, Mom. Good morning, Grandma. I am dying. I will be gone by tomorrow. Goodbye, Grandma. Everyone must go at some point. After high school, I would like to marry you for financial stability. I agree. It's the most logical thing to do. It is. Another day of learning has been completed. Hey! Hey, you! Yes, you! Do you know what an emotion is? Happiness, anger, love! Emotion? Are you making up a word? No, they're all real. Do you know why people get married? Yes, 
to repopulate the earth and for financial stability. It's for love. Man with emotion has been spotted. Oh no, I've been spotted. I don't have much time left. Take these tapes. It'll explain all the basics on emotions and there's more where that came from. The tapes will lead you where you need to go. Please.